Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to start a ZW CAD day one class. So in this in this video you are going to learn uh, you are going to see so these are the topics so we'll see first about introduction and next one will be software interface and next one will be uh, how to change uh, workspace from uh, classical to from classic to ribbon and also we will see a project unit setup how to change project unit setup in ZW CAD. So these are the topics which we are going to see in this tutorial. So watch the video till the end and do subscribe my YouTube channel for more videos and click on the bell icon for regular notifications. We'll see the introduction so introduction is nothing but so first we need to understand what is CAD so CAD is nothing but computer aided design or we can call it as drafting also so it is a use of computer based software to aid in designing process and CAD software is frequently used in different types of peoples like engineers architect and the interior designers and which are in AEC so these are the uh, typical uh, fields which we are going to use the CAD software okay and in this we can create a two dimensional and also the three dimensional moldings okay so basically it is uh, the company CAD soft which we they have started in 1998 and till now 2024 they are running and it is also a CAD programming ZW CAD is also an CAD program okay so now we will see the software interface how it will be So this is the ZW CAD. So it takes time. So this is the welcome dialog box. So I'm gonna try this. Select try option. And the software will be opened so while setup it takes time to load so this is the software interface of a ZW CAD now we'll see the interface. Interface is nothing but uh, I'm gonna select. See, this is the application icon. So at the top left side, top corner. So this is the application icon, and from here to here we can call it as quick access bar, and also from here to here title block, and So from here to here is heading, heading and this is all like sections, draw section, modify sections and annotation sections and layer sections and this is the block section and properties and clipboard and totally we can also call it as ribbon. So this is the ribbon or we can call it as like see here we have home menu uh, solid menu annotate menu so these are all menus we call it as and this is the workspace so this is this is all a workspace and this is the command panel at the bottom we have command panels so whatever the input uh, we, we want we just enter in this region okay so this is the 
software interface of a ZW cat so here you can find out a visual so it is in a 2d wireframe and the view is in top okay so now you have seen about a uh, software interface of an ZW cat right now we'll see uh, this is actually uh, it, it is in a ribbon right a ribbon format some people uh, want to work in a classical mode okay so for that you need to change the workspace to change the workspace see either you can select this option at the quick access we'll have an option called zw cat classic if you select this the entire software face will be changed okay next see same options uh, here we can see file menu edit menu view insert format tools draw tools and like this and also at the left side also we will see the draw tools modify tools and remaining options so these are the uh, uh, for uh, visual of classical mode and ribbon mode okay now uh, if you want to change uh, for ribbon directly now you won't you don't want to work on classical so what you have to do see, see here we cannot find the option that workspace so what we have to do means at the bottom right corner we have a setting setting a uh, set workspace and here you need to select the 2d drafting and annotation then the classical mode will be changed to 2d drafting and annotation with ribbons so it will be similar to autocad so some people will work on autocad also for them it will be easy to understand okay so now we have seen the so what we have seen so introduction we have seen software interface and also how to change workspace from classical to ribbon also we have seen right now we'll see a project unit setup how to set the project unit setup so uh, whatever it may be the drawing uh, if you want to uh, draft draft means we need to have units right so we have uh, units uh, like mm centimeters millimeters and feet and inches right so you need to set that uh, in a ZW cat so for that shortcut will be just UN enter either you can type a name also UNITS name also either you can use the shortcut UN enter okay so here you will get which type you want to select so here I'm gonna select decimal precision 0, 0.00 okay it is in a millimeters so if I click on ok so the drawing will be set it so we will just check so L enter for line select the any one point and on the F8 for straight lines and enter the 500 mm enter and enter okay and to check a uh, shortcut will be dimension di, di enter so from end point to the end point now we can check the dimension it is in mm 500 mm right now you want to uh, set in a feet and inches so how to do that means see either we can go with un enter or here you can find out one option see at the bottom here you can uh, check the drawing units click on this okay so see here we can find out millimeters directly you can change it into inches or feet or you can go with customize if you select the customize option also we'll get so now I'm gonna with engineering precision 0 feet and 0 inches and here I'm gonna select inches okay or we can change with architecture also okay so, so both will be the same so architecture and click on ok now I am just select L enter click on the point and now you can enter 30 feet 30 feet enter and enter ok 
same we can measure the distance and we can find out exactly so this is a 30 feet line so I think uh, now you have understand uh, the basic uh, sorry uh, beginner level of ZW CAD so in next coming session we can see the remaining topics and uh, if you like the video and do subscribe my youtube channel and thanks for watching and also uh, if anybody wants to learn the software in online training you can check the description i will give all the details and thank you